Today we're going to talk about using the normal distribution to find a data value for a given percentage. Suppose somebody wants to qualify to get into a uh, particular academy or school. And that person has to score in the top 10% on a, on a test. Well, if the test has a mean of 200 and a standard deviation of 20, we can find the lowest possible score that that person needs to qualify. So let's say that the distribution is normal, okay, and the mean is 200, our standard deviation is 20, we know that a person needs to score a particular score of X in order to qualify. And that X is within 10% of uh, the top score. So that has to be within 10%. So this area here to the right of X is 10%. or 0.01, sorry that's wrong, 0 0.10. So for this kind of problem, we're going to work backwards, okay? First of all, we need to find out what probability this is right here at X. So in other words, where is that on our curve? It's 1 minus 0 0.10, which equals 0 0.90, isn't it? So this point right here is at 0.9. So let's find the Z value for 0.9 by looking it up on our table. So let's find the Z value. And our table says that 0.9 has a Z value of 0.81 No, that's wrong. What we need to do is we need to look in the table and find 0.9 and find out what its Z values are. Because remember, no, we didn't. Okay. So the Z value is 1.28. Now that we know what the Z value is, we can use our formula Z is equal to 
our value minus the mean over the standard deviation to find x. Or x equals z times the standard deviation plus plus the mean. So z is 1.28. Remember from before that our standard deviation was 20 and our mean was 200. So 1.28 times 20 is 25.60. Add that to 200. And we get 225.60. So a score of 226 would be the cutoff. So a person would have to score 226 points or better in order to qualify on this exam.